Well, today, loved ones put to rest another Memphian, Joshua Allen Jones, the 24-year-old who traveled to Ukraine to assist during the war with Russia. And unfortunately, he did not return alive. Jay Shakur joins us in studio with more. Unknown to many, there are a lot of American volunteers who have gone over to Ukraine to offer their aid in various ways. Joshua Jones was one of those brave volunteers and today, joined by Ukrainian major, loved ones gathered to remember the courageous fighter and the loving family man. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The only thing that it takes for evil to succeed in this world is for good men to stand by and do nothing. And 24-year-old Joshua Jones didn't stand by. His family says he stepped up and stepped into a foreign nation's fight for freedom. My son uh, mm -hmm. believed in the fight. He believed that uh, the Russian aggression against a free, freedom-loving people was worth the sacrifice. A strong belief that provoked Joshua to volunteer to fight against Russian invaders initially joining the Norman Brigade, a group of foreign fighters fighting on the side of Ukraine. You know it was his calling. Ukrainian Major Guzowski remembers the warrior under his command. I can use just one word, a warrior. He was a true warrior and he was exemplary and he was sure about what he was doing. He was nicknamed Tactical Jesus for his long hair, beard and devout Christian faith. Joshua died on the battlefield in August of 2022. His father says his son's sacrifice is a testament to the fearless faith that made him a hero. Heroes are just those guys that are willing to go that extra mile and give that extra sacrifice. And that's what he was. A son of the Mid-South who fought for freedom far from home. You can be proud of such a son of the United States of America as Joshua Jones, and uh, he was a great representative of Memphis and people of Memphis and people of United States of America. Now, according to the U.S. State Department, at least five other Americans are known to have died fighting in Ukraine, just like Joshua. Back to you.